I don't need you anymore. No, I'm just kidding. I love you. I will use you again, but I don't need you. Oh my gosh, Draco Malfoy is freaking quaking. Malfoy? That's right. Okay. I should have filmed this earlier, all right? So I bleached my hair today. Well, I didn't. My hairstylist, Raina, bleached my hair today with the Arctic Fox bleach that is coming out soon. I just saw the final box. Very exciting. I started teasing this so early because I didn't think it would take this long to come out. So trust me, I'm trying to get it out and Ryan is trying to get it out. We're trying to get it out as soon as possible. But just bleached my roots today. I could not move to Nashville with the roots that I had going on. If roots are blended in nicely and it's like purposeful, I can get behind that. But when they're just like, just end like right there, like a solid like dark line, not so much into that. So lately I have been wanting to shave my freaking head because as much as my hair has grown back, I have the thin, cotton candy type of hair, even when before it was ever colored or bleached or anything. And it's just the type of hair that no matter what you do to it and how you style it with just what it is, it never really looks that good. It's usually flat to my head. It's like so unfortunate. If I could change one thing about myself, it would be my hair. I would just, I would almost give anything for that. Um, so I, keep getting frustrated because I wear my hair up in a ponytail every day because I go to the gym and then the moment I take it down is just like a frizzy, frazzled mess and you basically have to wash it and start over and put extensions in. So after I do my makeup and I put this outfit on, I'm like so tired at this point and I've already been getting ready for like two hours that I just like look at my hair and I'm just like, oh my gosh, what do I do with this? And then I tried to put wear wigs and put those on and I have not been able to get a lot of my wigs to like look good, like definitely not good enough to like wear out. So this is just me telling you my hair journey. I've been giving my hair a break from tape and extensions for the past few months um, so that I could just get my hair a bit healthier and it has grown back a little bit. My sides that come down from here are shorter than I'd like them to be. So Raina, my hair slash, she texted me. She's like, how are you doing? I'm like, I'm literally about to shave my head because I'm so frustrated with my hair and like it just never looks good like unless I spend so much like another 45 minutes putting extensions in perfectly and hiding them, etc. So I told her I said I think I need tapins again. So she just went to the store today. She went down south in San Diego to go get some extensions from me. These are hot heads tape and extensions and the hair goes all the way up. And um, she's gonna put these in my hair today, but we're gonna do something a little bit different than what you currently see. I do have a brand new baby pink that I'm gonna be trying out, but I'm not gonna put that in my hair today, but I did, here it is if you guys wanna see it, by the way. Look at this baby pink, this is so exciting. So I'm gonna be the guinea pig for that one, but let me turn my computer on here. I wanted to show you guys, hold please, I need both hands. So I'm gonna show you, I was like Pinteresting some stuff. And so this is kind of what I'm thinking I wanna do as far as like the shade by the root here, maybe a little bit lighter. I wanna do something like this so that when my natural hair starts growing out from the platinum, it's just not like a harsh line like this and it's kind of blended down a bit. So that's kind of was my inspiration and I like this one too. So probably something like this as far as the root area. And I'm excited to put tapins in again and hopefully I can do some more styles and stuff like this with those in. And hopefully it just makes it a lot easier in general. You are so out of focus, hi, there you are. So my house is like real packed up right now. Like it's, it's really getting there. Um, but Rain is gonna be back in a few minutes and then we will go ahead and start installing the extensions and I will show you that process. Raina is back with the extensions. Oh, that's Do nice. Do you like that? That's nice, Sorry. I like I like that fringe action. I have a fringe piece around here somewhere that I really okay, desperately Let's need help that. with. Where is it? I don't know, where is it? My kitchen is a disaster. Oh, here it is, here she is. Let's try this again, people. <laughs> Let's try this again, let's make it like. Do you think you want extensions? <laughs> 
These are the hot heads extensions she's gonna put in. So on one side she does the one with the hair all the way up and then the other side is just the tabby like this one, right? Yes. This one is a little harder to hide in hair like mine. Why is it so blurry? Focus! Um, so it's like that and then this one has the hair all the way up which she puts closer up and we cut them in half so that it's easier and less stress on my hair to like put up in ponytails, etc. Um, and here we go. Yep. Let's do it. So you guys, I'm wearing a bodysuit. It's like a frontal g-string, so I'm not <laughs> in my like, camel coat. Like, <laughs> look at my taco. I feel like it's like two tacos when you put like a g-string in the gross. middle of it. I'm a big bodysuit fan, but not this one. He's like, that looks like dental floss in the front. Vigine Do you area. sure you don't have it backwards? The thong? Did you put no, the thong in the front? Because this is the back. Unless my boobs are supposed to. Be <laughs> We're catching up on the MTV. Is it what is it? The movie award? The MTV music award. music awards. Movie yeah. awards. That's it. Wow, that was a long hair day. So this is what we have. I'm going to be. Styling this tomorrow very excited to do that. So we got to make sure that everything kind of matches up when it's curled and everything But um, it is so late. It's 1130 at night. I'm exhausted Raina is a trooper because she's got to get up at 4 a.m. Tomorrow and she stuck it out and finished my hair. So I really appreciate that um, But yeah, we're gonna go ahead and style it tomorrow. I have to get up Super early tomorrow as well. Not quite 4 a.m. Early that is I mean that you might as well just stay up But I don't even know how people do that. So I'm gonna be headed to sleep right now And if you're one of those people that get up at 4 a.m. You are my hero um, You gotta go outside Leonidas. I'm gonna let the dogs out. We're headed to bed And I'm gonna check in with you guys tomorrow when I style this and we'll, we'll take a little look-see and see what we got, but I'm so excited to have tape and extensions again. It's so much easier for me to style my hair. Blow drying is a bitch, but at least the styling part, so much easier, yes, 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 yes. Good night, we'll see you in the morning. Good morning or afternoon now. So it is the next day. I've had a chance to take a look at the hair in the light and um, the lighting of my house is super, super deceiving. So it looks like the top layers of my actual hair are a little bit lighter than these ones right here. So we're gonna get some platinum blonde that matches this a little bit better and pop some of these in here because there's none right here. And then I think this is going to match pretty damn well. I really like this shadow root a lot. It's like super natural for me, which I dig. Um, it'll be good for when my roots are going out too. But I'm pretty stoked on this. Like I feel so good to have tape and extensions again, like I said last night. Like doing my hair today was just so much easier and I'm so happy they're back. Praise Jesus, hallelujah. <laughs> so I will uh, update you guys on social media and whatnot when I put the other ones in. I just wanna go ahead and get this video out, but the extensions are back. Let me know what you think. Have you guys ever tried tape-ins? What are your favorite type of extensions that you've ever tried and what are the worst? <laughs> I have some stories, but you guys might have seen that if you've creeped my channel and seen, I had an extension removal video where Ryan helped me remove extensions and it was like after my wedding and I had gone in the salt water and stuff, it was brutal. If I can find it, I'll link it for you guys in the description box, but thank you guys so much for watching and we will see you in the next video. I'm also gonna be doing a video where I dye my hair a brand new color that we'll be testing um, for Arctic Fox because I need to check it and make sure that it is going to go over a blonde like this and at least leave some of the remnants of the shade. So I think I'm gonna film that. If you definitely wanna see that, give this video a thumbs up and let me know down below with a pink heart emoji. And one of you guys might get a shout out in that video for egging me on to do it. So oh, my shoulders are getting tired. I gotta go to the gym today still, take a photo. Um, so yeah, I think that's all I have to say here. We'll see you in the next video. Bye guys.